Hello, you've asked about fictitious disorders. So I'd like to explain fictitious disorders to you by explaining some other disorders that are very similar to it. First of all, fictitious disorders are a very unusual category of disorders. They are a group of disorders that relate to individuals who inflict harm on themselves or they claim to be ill solely for the purpose of getting medical attention. Now this can be confusing to some people and so I want to explain it to you by comparison. If I make reference to a hypochondriacal disorder, which is part of the anxiety disorders, I'm referring to a group of individuals who claim to be ill because they truly believe that they're ill. They may feel like they have cancer. Uh, they may think uh, they have a brain tumor. Many of you out there have known people who claim to be ill quite often. It almost is part of their identity. Now when we talk about malingering, this is a psychiatric illness that goes under the category of other potential psychiatric disorders. Malingering is distinguished from hypochondriacal disorder and fictitious disorder by the following. Individuals who malinger are attempting to get something in return for claiming that they're ill. For instance, one might malinger as a result of being in an automobile accident. The attempt would be to get financial gain. One might go to a medical office, claim to be ill so they can get medication. These sometimes are referred to as drug seekers. An individual may claim to be ill so they can get out of going to work. You might recall in your own childhood claiming to be sick to your mother and father so you could stay home for the day so you could get out of going to school or having a test. This is malingering. Fictitious disorder is different than the other two. Fictitious disorder is a claim of being medically ill, physically or mentally, for the sole purpose of seeking or getting medical attention. That is, they want attention from the medical community. It could be nurses, it could be doctors, it could be caregivers in general. So this is the general category known as fictitious disorders. Fictitious disorder, by definition, is part of the fictitious disorders. Now, hopefully you've listened to the discussion on fictitious disorders. So by definition, one who has a fictitious disorder is an individual who claims to be medically ill for the sole purpose of getting medical attention.